stepping 10 feet away every time I make it. Can I beat Simon? Let's find out. This is one of the classic Simon challenges back in 2020 when he, nobody was playing disc golf because of COVID and all that. Well, everybody was playing disc golf. Simon started putting out these videos where he would do some goofy challenges pretty much. So he did this one and it was awesome. It was one of my favorite disc golf videos to watch. And so I wanted to take it on because I'm practicing my up shots. He got to 160 feet. Which is ridiculous. Where I'm standing here, that's probably around 110. I don't even know if I'd get to here. I'm not sure. So I figured we would just get started and see how far I can go. One hour on the clock. Let's do it. This one should be pretty easy. There we go. Okay, I want to see how many I can make in a row. <laughs> Maybe, I hope just two. At least two. All right. Yeah, this is easy. Sweet, 30 footers. Okay, okay, there we go. Sweet, not a bad start. I wanted to get through those first ones real quick. We gotta move the camera back. We gotta move it back a little bit more. I think we're finally at the range of I just gotta start making them like rapid fire. Oh no, I gotta go get more discs out of my car. I even, I brought a bunch of putters and I brought some like overstable approach for some forehands. Oh, I shouldn't pull those out yet. <laughs> I should stick to the putts probably. Yes, last putter too. 50 feet. Oh, did I do a first try? <laughs> Ah, oh, off the top. It's fine. Maybe this is a good time to say that. What what distance am I going to get stuck on? That's the question. Comment down below what distance I'm going to get stuck on. Is it 50? <laughs> it was almost 40. I was scared for a second. Here's a useful tip I learned about upshots. I can't do standstills very well because my timing's a little off. So I do a little pump before. Seems to work out pretty good. Watch this. Pump. Good height. Good height, just off. I've been able to throw it in a couple of times recently. Yeah, all good height. Ugh. There it is. Let's go. You gotta scoot this back. 50 footer, down. A couple blunders on my part. One, I didn't bring a range finder, so I don't know distances very well, but I think it's pretty accurate. Two, I don't have a towel. All my discs are super wet. <laughs> so that's not good, but I'm getting used to it, so it's not a big deal. All right, 60 feet, starts now. Oh wow, that was nice. Oh, my third blunder, I didn't bring enough discs. <laughs> Should have brought like 10 more. You know, this challenge is hard and I really wanted to get to like the further ones. I might not make it out of here, out of the circle, out of circle two. I need the bag. Maybe, Envy? Off the top. If anybody has those like MVP baskets, there's like a nub on the top. I swear I bump that thing off every time I practice butt. So I just knock that off perfectly. Drop. No way. This is so hard. I, I underestimated this. Last one. Baby. No. for a refurbished basket. That's all that was. A couple things as I throw. We are about halfway through. <laughs> this is tiring. Every pro video I saw doing this challenge, they would be so winded at the end. And oh boy, that's true. I'm not even throwing very far. 
this is exhausting. Oh, but halfway through 60 feet, all I've done is hit putts I need to hit and throw it in from 50, which is not what I wanted. Very hard challenge, holy cow. And I gotta walk. I got 20 minutes left. This is so hard. Oh my gosh. All right, I gotta start gaming. I wanna at least get to 100. That's a lot though. Come on, Nomad. I've done that like 10 times. Yes! Oh my gosh. All right, 10 feet back. This is how I'm doing it. 10 steps or five steps. I feel much better from 70, honestly. I can actually throw it. I can actually throw the disc now. That feels so much better. 60 feet was like a little, a little bit too little. Like I have to half throw it. This is more of like an actual disc golf throw as I'm short. I got 15 minutes left. I'm at 70 but I feel much better from 70, honestly. So we can do this, you know? For having this be the worst, absolute worst part of my game, I'm happy with myself. At the same time, I'm very disappointed. Can't even talk. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. Oh, come on. Floaty. <laughs> oh, that's so nice. One, two, three, four, five, 80 feet. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. Oh, adjust the camera. Oh man, 80 feet, seven minutes left. See if I can get to 90, that would be something. Back to back. Okay, I mean, I gotta run, I gotta run. Berg? Oh, I like that Berg. Ah! <laughs> Berg off the cage. Harp, swing back. Nope. That one was close. Come on, I gotta hit it. Come on, man. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, 90 feet. 90 feet, 90 feet. I have a minute, a minute and a half. Oh man. <laughs> no way. No. That looks good. That looks good. Please. Oh, that looks good too. <laughs> Only a couple more. Bend. That's so short. Yes, Envy. Luna? Luna, yes, no. Six seconds, last one. That challenge was so hard. Holy cow. I was pretty confident going in, because, you know, it's whatever. But man. That was tough. Um, but I think I said this earlier, but being this is the worst part of my game, my least favorite. And like I'm getting better, like that was a scramble and I'm in the circle mostly from all those shots. So, you know, I'm getting better. This is all about improving this series. 
Uh, I really want to do this again, maybe after the off season, see how good I got. So let me know if you want to see that. Let me know if you want to see anything else. And bye. I'm not Simon. I'm sorry.